eight legs a spider has. They are not insects, but in a special class, for they are called arachnids with two body parts. How can we tell these animals apart? Now let's look at a spider, and you will see that a spider has eight eyes, but he has no wings, a cephalothorax, and the abdomen are parts of our little spider friend. Listen and I'll tell you just how a spider eats. Once the prey is captured, the meal won't retreat. For venom is injected, the prey is paralyzed. Then quickly the prey becomes liquidized. Now spiders, they have no teeth with which to eat. Like sucking from a straw, their meal becomes a treat. It might take several hours just to liquefy a fly, but well worth the wait for the spider's appetite. So cleanse in the abdomen, a spider will rely. Although they all don't spin webs, but silk they all supply. Spiders are important for they prey on insect pests that damage crops and do things that farmers detest. Insects bugs, but they aren't all true bugs. True bugs are grouped in a special class called Hemiptera, meaning half wing. The front wings of an insect in this class have a leathery base with a filmy outer edge. True bugs have sucking mouth parts and only go through three stages before developing into an adult. Bugs have a way of eating all their meals. They have a proboscis which is really ideal. They pierce their prey and then they inject Some poison that the victim doesn't expect They suck their meal in a peculiar way It's a straw-like motion of sucking their prey The liquid makes such a tasty snack that meal time becomes a special knack. Dead bugs, stink bugs, chinch bugs too. Our true bugs belonging to a special group. Hemiptera is a scientific name. We're not all insects, a group the same. Now all true bugs aren't predators, you see. For shield bugs, they suck sap from leaves. Bugs have very distinctive wings Yes, true bugs really are amazing things They certainly are amazing Did you know that the giant water bug can catch a small fish or frog with its hooked front legs? And water bugs can grow to be four inches long in South America Dead bugs, stink bugs, chinch bugs too Are true bugs belonging to a special group 